two, one. All right, guys, my name is Thomas Lampkin, and I'm presenting to you my electronic media kit for the Nike Tour. Components of a successful EMK are a background of the company that you're, uh, that you're presenting on, a pitch and intro letter, a news release, fact sheet, frequently asked questions, photos, features, or social media, uh, an audio news release or video news release, a contact list, and a media plan. Why create an EMK? EMKs help you uh, introduce a product, event, or a person to an audience and try to persuade them to gain interest towards whatever it is that you are presenting to them. EMK should be in a professional manner and explain in detail what the audience should be aware of in your EMK. So the Nike Tour is, uh, is gonna be put on by Nike at the world headquarters in Beaverton, Oregon. Um, you guys probably know Nike is one of the leading sports brands in the world. Uh, Phil Knight, the owner, has created a culture within its brand. The tour will be had, like I said, held at the headquarters along with eight major cities across the United States. Um, people will be able to go to the, uh, the tour, the campus, and uh, compete in many different competitions, have a chance to give back to local nonprofit organizations, as well as uh, win prizes and meet some of their favorite celebrities and athletes. So my, uh, my news release is Nike is pleased to announce the first inaugural Nike tour, which will take place and take part in eight large cities around the US and make its first stop in Portland, Oregon. Portland is home of the Nike World Headquarters, which is located just on the outskirts of Beaverton. The compound is over 275 acres and holds 75 buildings on the property, with dozens of football, soccer fields, outdoor sports courts, as well as indoor ones. And Nike could host a very prolific event that you won't want to miss out. Facts about the tour. The tour will open at 9 a.m. May 1st, 2019. Some special guests that will be included are Phil Knight, the owner, LaMarcus Aldridge, who played at Portland, Ken Griffey Jr., who's, uh, who's originally from Florida but played for the Mariners for a while, Mia Hamm, Russell Wilson, and many more. There will be, like I said, multiple tournament style games, including basketball, soccer, tennis, uh, throwing games for football as well as baseball. There will be a silent auction with gear, home goods, equipment, and memorabilia. Nonprofit organizations that will be in attendance, Boys and Girls Club of America, Make-A-Wish Foundation, uh, Junior Achievement Organization, and many more. And the prizes will be rewarded at the end of the competitions, uh, for the competitions at the end of the day, as well as Nike apparel and gear can be purchased throughout the event. Some frequently asked questions uh, for the Nike Tour was, what will I need to participate in the, to bring to participate in the event? Uh, a pair of athletic shoes, shorts, something that you can work out in, feel comfortable in. How will the money be distributed to the nonprofit organizations? So when you win any event or competitions, you can uh, choose where the proceeds go to, so you can kind of pick what nonprofit organization that you would like to donate to, as well as the, there will be tents throughout the entire campus where you can go learn more about the organization and, uh, and contribute there. Will there be food at, provided at the event? Yes, there will be. There's gonna be multiple food trucks food carts and catering set up at the event. If I bid on products and baskets but leave before the winners are announced, will I still be able to claim the prize? And yes, you will. We'll, uh, we will get your contact information during the event when you do place bids on the, in the silent auction and we will either send it to you or you can come to the headquarters and pick it up. Can we bring bikes or skateboards into the event? And we, we ask you to refrain from bringing any bikes or skateboards just because there will be a lot of people in attendance and we do not want them to get lost or, or stolen. So next is my, uh, my Nike photo sheet, my Nike tour photo sheet. And uh, athletes, like I said, can expect to you know, see a lot of this. We have basketball, three on three, five on five soccer, as well as tennis competitions. Um, this is part of Nike's campus that has beautiful scenery, as well as the, uh, the track where the half marathon will be ran. Some of your favorite athletes will be there. Come meet them and some coaches uh, and help make a difference in, in, in the society. Yeah. So the audio news release that I, uh, I did, I'll play just quickly for you guys. Hello, my name is Thomas Lamp and I would like to welcome you to our first inaugural Nike tour. The event will take place May 1st from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. at the Nike World Headquarters in Beaverton, Oregon. Nike has teamed up with multiple nonprofit organizations to help change the world one step at a time. 
Some of these organizations that will be in attendance are Boys and Girls Club of America, American Red Cross. All right, I'll stop there. So next we have, uh, we have the contact list that was uh, made to kind of help make this event possible. So these right here are, uh, are just a few of the nonprofit organizations that will be there. Uh, in order to make an EMK, I had to find the right people to contact in order to make sure that they're okay with coming to the event and uh, setting up a tent, as well as you know getting a lot of donations of money. Lastly, the media plan was something I had to create for the EMK, which uh, has all the components of the uh, final EMK that I had to complete the due dates by just to make sure that everything ran smoothly. And uh, that is it, that is the Nike Tour. Thanks you for your time.